Hey guys! <laughs> oh my god, here we are. I'm finally getting a chance to play Sonic Mania Plus. I have no- I have no- ah, Sorry, I can't even speak right now. I have not been able to access this game. I did not have the funds for it. College, cell phone bill, whatever. I have been too busy into my new schedule to be able to play this game. But finally, I've given myself an opening. A chance to actually sit down and play! And I'm gonna, I've decided I'm going to do a live reaction to the fact that I'm playing this game for the first time. Could you believe that it took me almost an hour to download this game? And I'll tell you why. Because PlayStation Network... I called them. I was on hold for 12 minutes before I could finally speak to someone. You, I, I paid for this game. I had a proof of transaction and everything. But if you download it from your personal computer, you're going to have to run through a couple different menus on different versions of the PlayStation website first. I want to get down to specifics, but right now I, I just want to play the game. I've been waiting forever to play this game. It's, it came out last year, I think? Yeah, 2017. Oh my god. I'm finally playing Sonic Mania. Okay, let's see if the controls are still the same. Because I, it's been a while since I played the classic games. I'll give you my history of Sonic as I go. I love Sonic games, though. Mania mode, Encore mode. Options. Let's see. Clean. Chris. Soft. I think clean is good. Sound. Controls. Okay, yeah. Simple. Simple. Data. Oh, I could do replays. Oh, that's nice. Awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go for... I wanna go for Encore mode, but I have not played Sonic Mania to the extent that most people have. I guess I could try this game options. Okay. Time limit on. Okay, cool. Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, somebody. Oh, wow. I, could, I can go as one of these five and I can have Tails with me if I'm Sonic. All right. Let's go for, I guess, Sonic and Tails. It's like I never left Sonic the Hedgehog 3. I don't know if I'll be making episodes of this. I just want to play live until I can get the feel for it. I mean, I like playing live. I mean, I like playing and uploading video clips. So we came back to Angel Island, and here we are at Green Hill. Huh. Interesting choice. And for Sonic games, I usually play with the D-pad. I do not play with the control stick, because it makes no sense to use a stick in a 2D environment. At least, that's my way of thinking. Let's see, how to do the spin dash? I think I hold down and circle? Yeah. Because we're It's weird, in Generations, you have to hold down and circle to do it. But here, I think I can hold down and jump. Yeah. Oh my god, it's like I'm playing Green Hill Zone all over again. Because I, mean, I technically am. It feels like playing Sonic 1. Except Sonic 1 never had the spin dash. I, I'm not doing the sphere stages. I'm just not... Like, I need more... Pr I need practice. I need time to get ready. I do want to get that Thunder Shield. Some of my best memories of playing Sonic <laughs> come from the time where I bought a, a game, a disc, on PC called the Sega Smash Pack. Sega Smash Pack 2, I believe it was. Because that's also what I used to get my hands on Shining Force. I wasn't a big Shining Force fan until I played the game. I remember there was this combo pack where you could play as Vector Man, you could play uh, Alex Kidd, Kid Chameleon, Golden Axe. Whoa, careful, I almost grabbed a Robotnik item. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. I still feel like a natural at these games. It's been forever since I played them, but the old training never goes away, I guess. Okay. Should I go in the ring? Yeah, let's try it. 
Oh wait, this is- Oh, so this is the special stage. Okay, okay, since I'm in a 3D environment, yeah, I, I don't mind using the control stick to move Sonic around. Let's see if I can grab the first emerald. Yeah, Sonic's not exactly... Uh, he's kind of slippery here. Let's see if I can grab rings. If I don't, I don't. Man, this feels like that 3D UFO setting from Sonic CD, but a little bit more intense. Just need to grab the Chaos Emerald. And if I don't do it well now, I'll try to focus on the other stages later. If I don't end up beating this game with the Chaos Emeralds, I will try my best to just play the game overall. Wow. Okay, so I can't spin dash here. All I can do is run. Okay, so I'm going in circles then. Grab the first emerald. I feel like I'm not gonna, but you know what? Let me try anyway. Yeah, I'm probably not going to make it. Yeah, I'm not going to make it. <sighs> Sucks. I really tried. I just need to get used to these special stages. I've never played these types before. I'll try again. Another time. Okay, so I guess I can go down below. Well, 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 where am I- where am I headed to? This Green Hill is not the same as the one I knew previously in other Sonic games. Oh, I'm already at a boss? Wow! Okay, hold on. There we go, there we go. There's its weakness. When it's red, I can't... Oh. There we go. It's been a while since I played the classics. It's... It's still something to get used to. I haven't played Sonic in a while since... Uh, Generations. And that was five years ago. Maybe more. Generations was 2011, I think? Back when I used to be good at Sonic on PS3. But it's not just this game. Every time I play PS4 with the controller... You see, I'm trying to talk and play, and it's really difficult. Every time I play with the PS4 controller, I'm not really that good at it. I don't know why. PS3 was easy. I used to be better in Double May Cry HD, for example. Whoa, whoa, careful, wow. Hmm. Okay. This is definitely not the Green Hill Zone I knew. Hmm. Can I get momentum to be able to go up there? Let me see. Whoa, hold on, hold on. Oh, I can't because the spring is in the way. It's going to stop me.
Just need to find another ring portal. That special stage was something interesting, though. I want to try again when I get a chance. Oh, wait. How did I do this before? Okay, that didn't work. Do I have to run? Okay, I got it. Can I get on top? Oh, okay. Probably not. I don't want to touch that. that. That looks like the bomb from Sonic CD, where if you touch it, uh, that's an instant explosion, and you lose your rings, and you can't destroy it. What if I jump? Okay, I'm stuck behind the screen. Alright. Behind him, I mean. In the screen. This was not bad. I feel like there's one more act. Is there one more act? Or do I go on to the next zone? Yeah, I'm going on to the next zone. Oh, wait. Okay, there's more. Yeah, keep in mind as I'm saying this, I have not played Sonic Mania at all. Oh boy, it's like treading old ground again. I say again because we've played this stage dozens of times.